My friend once used laughing gas as deodorant. Tell you what, it smelt funny. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget, comment your jokes down below. Right, so hello again, everybody. Welcome back. I've seen a lot of people say that Google have deleted apps from their device, whether it be an Android phone or an Android TV device like an NVIDIA Shield, and it looks like Google have made some kind of update to their Play Protect. Now, I'm going to show you how you can fix this, but I've also seen a few videos telling you to do something that... I don't think's necessarily needed. Right, so that being said, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and let's crack on. Right, so first of all, what I will ask is do comment down below if you had this issue. Right, so as you can see behind me, I've got some streaming apps installed and these are the apps that are having the biggest issue. So if first of all, I come onto my Android phone and I want to install a streaming app, I'm guessing you've all heard of this one. I'm going to click install, give it a couple of moments, and then as you can see, it says blocked by Play Protect. This app is fake. It tries to take over your device or steal your data, which sounds like some serious shit. <laughs> and then you can click OK, and this will simply not install the app to your device. But it says details, and we've got a drop down, and it says even if you have heard of this app or the app developer, it's still dangerous to install an app from an untrusted source. And then now we get the option to install anyway. Now, when it comes to streaming apps, it's something we've covered for a very long time. We know they're safe, but don't select install anyway if you're not sure about the app. So when I click on that, it's now going to install that app to my device. It should say install succeeded in a moment, as you can see there. And then as you can see, it's installed. I can open it and use it as normal. Now, something that's been recommended is to turn off Play Protect, which I wouldn't recommend. You're kind of leaving your device vulnerable. And inside the Google Store, in the top right-hand corner, you've got your app logo or your icon. Click on that, and then you can see it says Play Protect. If we click on that, it's now showing me I've got one harmful app installed on my device. To turn off Play Protect, we can click Settings in the top right, turn that off, and click Turn Off, and then you'll no longer get that blocked notification. But I recommend that you leave that turned on. Play Protect is just there as a safety net. So once it's turned back on, I'm going to click on back. And if I go back home, you can see that the app's actually been removed from my device. But it's not being removed. If I go back into Play Protect inside the Google Store, you can see I now get the option to enable app. And when you click on enable app and enable, you can see it's now back on there and it wasn't actually deleted. Another thing with Play Protect as well, if we just click on Learn More, it's telling you it checks your device for potentially harmful apps from other sources. These harmful apps are sometimes called malware. Now, malware, as we know, is something you don't want on any of your devices, but by turning off Play Protect, I don't know if you're then enabling apps to be able to install stuff themselves. Now, I'm not going to read the rest of it. You can go and have a look if you want, but I don't want to bore you too much. So that's what's happening on Android phones. Now let's have a look at Android TV. Now, as you can see, I've got some streaming apps installed. I'm just going to quickly remove one. And then I'm now going to try installing the app again to this device, clicking install, give it a couple of moments, and then we should get that notification as we do there. Click on details, and I want to install anyway. And don't forget, I've not turned anything off in the settings. I'm still able to install apps. And then we should see it say down here, install succeeded. Once I go back home, you can see it's now installed again. I can open that and use it as normal. If you do want to turn off verify apps or play protect on Android TV, you can go to the top and go across to settings, go to apps, and then at the bottom it says security and restrictions. Click on that and then you can turn off verify apps. It does say this will disallow or warn before installation of apps that may cause harm. And if you do turn that off, you'll no longer get that blocked notification. But I'm going to leave that turn on everything's working as normal so i don't see the need to turn it off and one more thing to bear in mind as well is this isn't happening with all streaming apps or all third party apps if i want to go and install this one here i'm going to leave it a moment and i don't get no notification no warning and it should say install succeeded and that's it as you can see click on home it's appeared there and that's not deemed by google as a harmful app 
So you can either try to find some alternatives that aren't flagged as harmful, or you can use the install anyway feature to be able to install third party apps without turning off Play Protect. If you do think apps have been deleted from your device, go into Play Protect, see if you can enable it, and then it should appear back on your device. Right, so I'm going now. It's been a bit of a boring video, I do apologize. I just wanted to let you know about it. If there's anything I've missed, do let me know in the comments section down below. Hopefully, this video's helped at least one person. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below, because um, I'm watching this. And I'll see you soon. ta -da. If you do think that apps have been deleted from your device, Go into Play Protect, see if you can it. See if you can what? Right, so hello again, everybody, and welcome back. I'm seeing a lot of people saying that. Right, so hello again, everybody, and welcome back. I'm seeing. I'm. 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 So you can either. So you can either try. So you can either try. So you, I can't say that, can I? <laughs>